Oh my god, this summer never ends. I, of course, I love summer. Come on, guys. Welcome to my channel. My name is Jan Boris, a new masterclass. Very, very hot one. Or not, depends on how you will take it. Because today I will be talking about Sylvester Belt's Look Talk song representing Lithuania at Eurovision 2024. And I will be describing it, the flaws and the positives of this staging. And I think it's something like half and half, but it's not a review. Don't take it as a review, it's more like a description of the staging, like a breakdown of the staging, analysis of the staging on what is good or bad. Of course, it doesn't matter what I think about the song, if I like it more better than something else, this is not a comparison to other songs. It really has to do with the stagings and how the staging adapted the song and showed the song in the best possible way. Did it make it or not? Let's talk! Alright guys, welcome back to my channel, welcome here and let's dive in to this staging, shall we? We will first watch it together, all of it, with some of my commentary, random, and then I will go and step by step will describe you what I like, what I dislike, at the same, at the, at the concrete face of the song. So let's do it, let's do it like I do it all the time together, watch my other masterclasses, so maybe I will skip some steps you already should know. Watch the masterclasses to... You know, I don't want to repeat for everybody who's watching it every single time the same thing because they already know. Let's do this. Okay, let's check the noise. I really pity that they don't write who's the, the staging, who's responsible for the staging. Okay, this white, this blue strip. Somehow reminds me of this Russian song, really, from 80s or... It's a cosmic, blue colors. It's kind of somehow mysterious, but in a very, very strange way, because you have concrete hands. The thing is that no one understands what is the song about, right? We must also take it as a consideration. This, this is where the song starts for me. Things going, red color. He's not having charisma in his eyes. I think this is... The, the, no emotions there. The, the rest works. Nice camera angles. Simple graphics, but effective. Nice. The transition is very beautiful. Also, this angling, this uh, composition is brilliant. I'm not fan of this because it, it's from completely different universe than the rest, than the previous things. But I like the color shifting. It was very dynamic, very fast. And then we are going again, the same what we already have, but it's, it like speaks one body. Now, finally, also he's starting to have some emotions. Even he's feel, feeling like static, you know? He's not appealing to me with charisma and something. That, that, wasn't, that wasn't a good shot. Okay, let's go, let's go. The dynamic is there, created very nicely. This is this shot is not good because I know that they have this graphic, but this is a nice shot with the steady cam showing the arena. This works. I think it should have come in sooner a little bit, and this works. Now they're combining both colors, and now the whole proposition of the blue and red makes sense much more. And they enhance it on this idea, so now really actually it makes kind of sense. Now, it, now I think that I think they tried a lot. I think the issue this is even this is not a review of the song. Then where the staging came also a little bit with the limits. It's a monotonous song. Long, which if it should already have ended, you know. But they, what they've done, they were, they were doing tempo. Amazing service with the lights and with the edit. In my opinion, they also with the camera movements, they've done a lot. Of course, not everything is perfect. Now we can, for example, see what is very fascinating for me that he has this, having this dress, which doesn't look really good. But that's the difference between dresses which are made for cameras and which are not really made for cameras and for specific environment which they created on stage. 
because in this proposition all the dresses basically looks it doesn't they don't they don't work right but this is not the setup they were using them but in the setup they were using them they were working perfectly and this is the difference between fashion and between television you must count what you have with the lights with the cameras with what reflecting what because it's completely different light than how it looks in like real life like this it doesn't matter how it looks in here and that it doesn't fit or maybe does but doesn't fit the guy you know now he looks like a doll in the shot in the red and blue he was looking kind of very artistic normal the way that you don't even think about those things i think this is important to say although those guys you know so this is just one thing which is some one of the new informations I'm, i can tell you teach you in here i think ellie will tell you much more in detail but for me for the director's perspective and also experiences i have this exactly sh showcase what good dress means in a, because you do it for the specific environment you don't do it you don't go on stage it's not a fashion molo it's not a fashion catwalk it's done you know it's a different thing and uh, if you approach it as a random fashion week it, it will not work because this that comes with completely different rules but this is uh, this is uh, from it but let's start from the beginning <laughs> sorry I'm a little bit so I think what a little bit is because artists it's is part of the staging that the lack of energy in the first half like costs a little bit uh, of the feeling I think maybe somehow because I was thinking about it a lot this is like a generational approach that this generation is not really able to give those real emo like they are or giving different kind of emotions it feels like they don't have them i it so reminds me of the acting in star wars acolyte for example where is no acting where is no emotion feeling no emotion building yet some people especially around 20 say like oh my god it was very emotional it's like i don't any i i don't feel it so this is one thing that Eurovision also is done for everybody, but if this artist is just want to focus on some specific generation, this is something I don't want to hate. But this is the feeling from me that I would at least ask him, because the voters at Eurovision are from all generations, just spark, you know, find it, find it. Anyway, they, they started with this blue pillar. They have very nice reveal of the dancers. It's, you know, you can see, and I think for the one who are new in here, of course, this is just few of you, or I don't know, but <laughs> what I like in here is that every single sound, like, <laughs> it's accented by the visual, which creates, it gives the depth of the sound. It's like, whenever you, like, if, if I do this, it's a difference, like, when I do this and you, you cannot hear anything, right? It's a it's a bit different it it proposes the sound to the action it's a very old good fashion trick which will always work because this is how our brain works because it's connected to when something falls and create a sound you hear the sound and you get scared because that can save your life and this is how we are thinking with uh, visualizing sounds it's very important for us so if you visualize visualize uh, the sound or you have effect or something uh, it better it just really works but it must be on time because then if it's not it can create the opposite effect it can disturb you uh, but in here it's done very well so look look at help he was I don't remember when it exactly had the phrase See, and they did it. I hope I will be able to really move it just a little bit. I like the way how it was done. So it's not like that just it's because the sound is a little bit longer. Very good. Logical. The other beats are not supported. This is a little mistake, but they didn't go no, again. Like it's again, it's not that it's like the sound is and you can also see this with lights they don't do like all at the same moment this i don't really get this because 
you have I don't get the one thing when you choose the design which is basically lines strips why do you go with another kind of magic I, I, I think choose one style and enhance it like Swedes did they used one style they kept the style they were just making it more robust yes this is what you should do this is from I, I know it's it, it you can call it this is subjective but actually it's not actually this is this is a mistake don't do overlays of things with, with completely con contracting things you go you go architectural you go you don't combine architectonic styles together also like in very rare moments those things really work but most likely they don't like one building created by like the facade of the building created by five, by five different styles it's not a good idea right so you must be very careful how you use the real effects with some mist elements and with the very technical you know just makes no sense would be better and they, they switch to technical completely almost it's better and whenever they put different element it's like the alien element which doesn't belong but okay let's continue they create they also work very nicely the choreography they don't take the attention but they also work nicely with the music so they are present they dynamize the picture very well i think in my opinion as those shades it really works well and then later it dynamized even better and that's it because the focus is on him which is i think this is the very important part that he doesn't work good on this light okay i think this is more about the expression that he misses the spark in the eye amazing transition amazing light transition simple an amazing transition to another color Again, you can see how the clothes are taking the colors. You don't know basically what kind of color the dress has, right? You would never probably say it's red. So it looks good. And they look the same still. He is dominant. He is dominant in this picture. Amazing edit. It works. Nice transition. And I like this transition really. That they, it's a typical element, which is good. They were the only thing again, they were using the straight lines. Now it's this kind of curve, which in this moment looks very good. The issue is the next step where somehow it, they didn't make it sensible in the way creatively because putting artists into the screen, it's zero creative. It's basically when you don't have an idea, you put the artist in the screen all the time. That's why I don't like it. Of course, it makes sense in the concerts, at the concerts, because it's effective. This is about the artist on the concert. People pay to see only this artist. So I understand it. But at Eurovision, the, in my opinion, this is just lack of creativity. This is absolute lack of creativity. Whenever you put artists in the screen, it means that you didn't have an idea, in my opinion. Anyway, uh, this shot amazing against the use as a transition of colors. Like I love it. I like this is this is wonderful. You know, this is a frame. This is this, this put you can put on the frame. It will look really good. You know, even even with this sunny curve. But why they do this? I don't understand. I like the light play. I really like the light play. I don't like this. It doesn't. First of all, it doesn't look at, at all as him. For second of all, it's the same angle it's the same profile of his just one is put here the other here is just the mirror mirrored which doesn't look realistic and it makes no sense why are you doing this what makes sense is choreography what makes sense is camera movement what makes sense is the support lights the minimalism in here which is constantly somehow killed by making it big don't why it's not and also this when you map also when you oh, this this player is not good but when you uh, I, mean, I think i skipped uh, yes so amazing transition atypical i like it keeps the attention now First of all, this is not really mapped very well. It don't feel like he's singing it. It feels artificial, not good. Other thing, it takes too much attention 
for zero effect. What is the effect? To see him, I don't even know what he's singing. You know, like I think we must understand as creators that when we, when we are, especially when we are doing in our native languages, that no one has a clue what does it mean. Of course, you have hardcore fans who knows, but it's it's not even one percent of people who watch the show. So you must be clever about it a little bit more. If show or don't show, don't be that if you don't need to, but. You were using nice aesthetics, why you go this way? I don't understand. This is nice, this is better, you know? I, I see him. I see. And I didn't see Let's Go, I would like to see like... But anyway, it was good. This is just a choice. I like the tempo doing... Okay, I don't understand the, his face in the... Because I don't understand his face in the LED screen. First of all, you can see how far they are from the screen, how actually in this... In this frontal shot, how it looks that it's just like this behind them, right? So this is the because it's very tall, it's very big. The perspective is different. Is the is this Fata Morgana effect? You know, like uh, this is what it is. This is this is the big downside of big screens. They would do better if they do the choreography a little bit more in front. It would look much better, much better. They will give it a more space. It can be a little bit blurred. It can they can work with these details and they it would feel even more spatial. In my, this is like uh, this is this will be better. This would be really better. Of course, they would lo lose this top shot, even though which I think just worked like two times, three times with very specific moments in choreography. So who, for example, like Portugal, very likely was using this, and the reason was that they give the space to everything, and that's why it looks so good. It was very clever. It was because they understood the perspective. So many, and I think I can tell it here, but it's issue of many, many choreographies and many, many stagings, including Czechia, including not really Ukraine. Ukraine played it very well, but recently I was doing. Uh, 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 who was it? Oh my god. Well, check it. I don't. I. I now cannot remember. But there were more. Uh, for but for example, also Greece, which they had, in my opinion, kind of a concept at 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 some moment on stage. But they forgot completely that first idea where it needs to happen. It's the camera, camera movement and edit. This is where you start. This is actually where you start. Even it maybe makes no sense. But who starts with this? Basically, who starts with the idea? how I want it to really look as the outcome, then they create the staging for the cameras. If you create a staging and then you add cameras to find it, you do exactly those mistakes. You do mistakes because you forgot about the perspective. You for forget about where to place your artist to have the best picture, what fits them. And it's too late. And then, then those, I know it's maybe for you not a mistake because the light's working, everything in here, but imagine how much better it would look because also you put up you can add the more of the power of those boxes and so on. But uh, this is when you do more like a choreography than, and then you're thinking how you edit it and make it with the cameras. With this song, it's very straightforward with the editing and they do it very well in the editing, like 100%. Also with those effects, so it works. Tempo dynamics works in very well. Imagine when they are, you know how it seems? It seems like it's like one meter behind them, right? Imagine they are another four meters in front how bigger how actually more cool it would look even though i like this for example this framing it's really really good i like it it's uh it looks really good really also the choreography is good it's very simple you know simplistic but this this is a good idea <laughs> nice and again this those realistic top shots what do you want to say? You are a dancing song or you're telling me some story or it's technical. Don't complicate it. It's You have three minutes to sell it. You have three minutes to sell something. Be straightforward, be clear and then enhance one thing. In here you are chasing too many, too many rabbits, even not that many as on some other countries, but you're still chasing them and it doesn't work do effect instead of hands and something be still you know stay in the same space don't change it don't change the houses it's confusing although he was lost in here because he was in shade nice 
I like the transition song. They do this as a beat. Much better it would be looking if they keep straight lines. This is nice. The strobo, perfect. This is favorite part for me. This, this really would look good. The choreography makes sense. They are all together. They are all visible. He's the most. They go look though. Now it loses dynamics. From this moment it loses dynamics. The camera, what they should do to do it better is one thing. Faster camera movements, faster editing now. Because they already... Because now you're... Basically you did the job and now let's let's finish it. You must build, 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 build. You cannot make me fall down. And of course the song is made somehow, but you must find the moment. So maybe this should be looking differently. He looks like he's super bored in here. Just this is not, this is also not good. They should play more with the camera, like they did with the dancing. Because this, this tempo is dead, it feels they already don't have energy, it's very slow, but I think the problem, the issue, the main issue of mine is the slow cameras in here. Now they are slow, they should be like... You, you see, because whenever they use the more dynamic camera, it looks just better. Because now everything feels like, it's, it's our, this is after party, you know, this is already after party. Even there's nothing like wrong by lights and so on, it feels emptier. You know, for example, when they use this effect, it feels quite good. Because it corresponds, right? This corresponds with the aesthetics, with the most of the aesthetics. I, and I like how they played with this transitioning. This is really good. And really like the dress. No, there's bullshit. Uh, in my opinion, Halfway there, maybe three quarters there. Not really bad staging at all. Really simplistic. I like the design. There were some little mistakes, or maybe big. Doesn't depends on the perspective. But some things artists should be very, very aware of. One is first think about cameras and edit. What you want to see in the, each frame. Then what should happening over there. What you want to sell. This I think this is the first step. Focus on what is the idea, keep one style, one visual style, it doesn't mean that you cannot use different colors or something, but just keep it in one area, because then it will feel like a real idea, not like, let's put it, because then, you know, your brain would say, okay, they wanted to, it's, it's this, and that, and this, and that, and there's nothing. You, it must be kind of clear, it doesn't matter, it can have a story. It can have everything, like uh, the Nemo, it has a story of the switching, blah, blah, blah. Okay, but it's just another layer for nerds. First do it simplistic, clear, simple, straightforward. It's three minutes, it's not a movie. So it's possible to do it like this. And then you have halfway winning. And then of course it's about the performance of the, of the artist, about the song and so on and so on. But with the clear design, this had amazing lightning, amazing transition, some very good ideas and just so few details and then the last 15 seconds which switched you off and maybe those last 15 seconds will be absolutely alright if you don't have those switch off moments and also don't use face in the LED. This is always like if it makes, if it just don't really make super sense, don't do it just don't it don't bring anything it just feels that you copy paste uh your layout from the from the concert but that's all from me from now i hope you enjoyed that you learned something new and that you will watch my other master classes so you will understand the whole context of what i'm saying because of course now i'm not talking even about so many other details like beating all the lights and so on because i talked about it in many many others and it would be the repetition so I hope you enjoyed, I hope you, I don't need you to agree with me, I know I'm right what I'm saying to you, but uh, maybe you found out something else or you have some questions you would like to ask me, I will gladly answer you if it would make sense for me, if not I will ask you again like how do you mean it of course, and cannot wait for it, so see you next time, thank you for watching, bye.